When you go to a conventional doctor for a conventional problem, even for your annual physical, the testing that will be done for you is not very advanced with regard to advanced perspective testing. They will not test you genetically. They will not test you typically with MRI or CT scanning looking at very early signs of disease. You see, all disease is curable if caught at stage one. For example, cancer at stage one may be, the tumor may be as small as a pea. But if you wait till stage three when a tumor is the size of a golf ball or a grapefruit, then it's very hard to cure that disease. The disease has had a chance to establish itself within you and it's going to very possibly, very probably kill you. So you don't want to find a disease at stage three or stage four or stage five. You want to find a disease at stage one when it's first making its expression or even pre-stage one. And that's what anti-aging medicine focuses on. It focuses on the very early detection and prevention of disease. Because even cancer is 95 to 100% curable if caught at stage one. It falls drastically after that stage. Now, cancers take years to develop within the body. So why aren't we looking at for those cancers at every stage of every person's life? The same thing for heart disease, same thing for Alzheimer's disease, same thing for arthritis, same thing for diabetes, same thing for every degenerative disease known to man. My advice, go to an anti-aging practitioner, someone who's board certified and fellowship trained by the American Academy of Anti-Aging Medicine, and go through that, that intensive, advanced, scientific testing. Isn't it a very wise expenditure of funds to find out metabolically what is in your future by testing for today? I think so. And that's the position of the American Academy of Anti-Aging Medicine.